Adding plants to your shower offers multiple health benefits, including improving your air quality, increasing your energy, and boosting your mental health. Plants can create a relaxing atmosphere and add vibrance to any room by reminding us of nature. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you 10 best bathroom plants you can grow successfully in the shower. Before that, please like and subscribe to support my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Number 1. Moth Orchids Moth orchids have a short stem that bears several broad leathery leaves. Most species are epiphytic with thick roots and do not require soil to survive. Moth orchids are great year-round, but they're especially well-suited for cold days when you're spending a lot of time indoors. Their elegant flowers will brighten tables and windowsills in your home for months at a time. Number 2. Staghorn Fern The staghorn fern is an unusual plant, being both an air plant and a fern, though it bears little resemblance to most ferns. The plant grows on tree trunks or rocks, absorbing moisture from the humid air and collecting nutrients from the falling leaves of overhead trees. The staghorn fern can be grown as a houseplant or outside in gardens with mild climates. Most typically, it is mounted on a surface and displayed on a wall, like a piece of art in its own right. Number 3. Spider Plant One of the easiest of all houseplants to grow under any circumstances, a spider plant also is a great choice for the shower. Initially looking like grassy clumps of foliage, spider plants begin sending out shoots as they mature, Baby plants soon grow from the shoots. Allow the baby plants to stay on for a trailing effect, or trim them back and start new plants. Spider plants tolerate low to bright light. Number 4. Pothose. Pothose is a trailing houseplant that's easy to care for. It thrives in a wide range of conditions, including low light situations, and is tolerant of neglect. Watering is one of the most important aspects of pothose care. Pothose do best in soil that's evenly moist. Allow the top inch or so of soil to dry out before watering. One of the most important factors in growing pothose is humidity. Pothose should be watered on a regular basis but not too frequently. Number 5. Earth Stars Earth Stars are bromeliads grown for their interestingly patterned foliage. They live naturally on tropical forest floors where low light and high humidity are the rule. In the shower, simply ensure they have a bit of water collected in the cups where the leaves attach to the plant. Number 6. Lucky Bamboo Lucky bamboo is a perennial herbaceous plant that is popular as an indoor plant because it is easy to take care of. Lucky bamboo can be grown in water if you want an easy care house plant. When growing lucky bamboo in water, a layer of pebbles must be put over the roots to help keep the plant steady. If your lucky bamboo plant is bigger or more established, you may want to plant it in soil instead. Lucky bamboo can grow in soil, but it needs special care. Number 7. Calathea. Calatheas are simple to care for. But if they do not receive proper care, they will be sure to let you know. To keep your calathea happy, make sure it is in a pot that drains well. Since it is by nature a lower, shade-growing plant, it does not like direct sunlight. But it does enjoy bright spaces with indirect sunlight. Your calathea will thrive in more humid environments and does not adapt well to drastic temperature changes, so be sure to keep it away from vents. Number 8. Peace Lily 
Peace lilies grow best in evenly damp porous soil where the roots have adequate access to both moisture and fresh oxygen. Moist soil is good, but soggy wet soil is bad. When repotting your peace lily, a soil mix of half potting mix and half orchid mix is generally recommended. Peace lilies can actually grow in pond water as long as the water is flowing enough to provide fresh oxygen to the plant's roots. Number 9. Peperomia. A small plant that thrives in low light, Peperomia. A small plant that thrives in low light, Peperomia is another great plant for the shower. It does not require frequent watering, but responds well to high humidity. Heat Peperomia in an elevated spot to avoid overspray when showering. Number 10. Heartleaf Philodendron. Heartleaf Philodendron, commonly known as the sweetheart plant, is an evergreen foliage plant native to tropical regions of South and Central America and the West Indies. It is a popular houseplant, offering year-round beauty and easy care. The leaves are dark green, but when they first emerge they're often bronze-colored, giving this plant plenty of visual interest. On rare occasions, a mature plant may produce small greenish-white flowers. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to support my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. And see you in the next videos.